Well, hello, how are we doing today? Hey, this is your friend Kirkland from Daily Momentum. You all know I have a YouTube channel, Daily Momentum. What I am always wanting to do is trying to get you into a momentum to keep you pushing and pushing each day. Hey, it is exciting to be able to join and to communicate with you all each and every day. Uh, I surely appreciate you all for listening to my videos all the time or just dropping a comment or subscribing or just liking it. I really appreciate that. I'm always going to be uh, humbly appreciated about that. So if you have time while you're listening, uh, subscribe to the channel if this is your first time uh, coming to my channel to just try to support me in trying to get these momentums out to most people so they can get their day started. Everybody needs a, a momentum to keep going. Today, I would like to talk about one word today. Um, I'm always using these words to just make them explode out because sometimes we lose value of different words in our lives or different, just small things in our life that we kind of overlook. So what I am doing is trying to uh, just help you out along the way to help you to understand. The word that I want to talk about is sacrifice. We all know at the beginning um, and just the word of God talks about sacrifice. The main and number one word and the scripture that was in the Bible was talking about John 3.16 is a very popular a lot of people can quote it backwards I mean it's probably was one of your first scripture that you was known about John 3 16 for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son was that a sacrifice and that's what I'm talking about a sacrifice in our life things that we need to do in our life sacrifice sacrifice to me would be is that you give up something of value in the present so that you can improve the future. So that's what um, God was doing, was making a sacrifice, giving up something of value for the, for the future so we can improve and it helped us. It even allowed us to have the anointing of God, the, the Holy Spirit in our lives just many things and so as us being human we have to like I'm doing right now is presenting a lot of momentums and daily momentums of the encouragements things to help people along the way throughout the future that's going to help people out if someone can come to this channel and say hey man thank you man I really appreciate it, man you making that sacrifice for all these years you didn't have a lot of subscribers but you meant a whole lot to me and I appreciate that. You know, I get people telling me about different things like that. So what I'm doing is making that sacrifice is being able to do it because I enjoy doing it. I enjoy talking to people, making people feel better, making them feel excited to help them going. My day is not always uh, up and up and up. I have to motivate myself so I use these skills to help other people out to get them going, you know. So I have to use these same things on me. So let's try to make a sacrifice about uh, inputting or educating people or doing different things or even the skills that you have that can take along the way to help people learn about different things that you are doing. I mean, if it's just ministry, if it's just uh, being a dancer or a hairdresser or many skills of being a student, you can put them skills out and allow people to be able to improve in their life throughout the years. And sometimes people think, like some people come to me and say, hey, man, you lucky, man. You so lucky, man. You lucky. I mean, look, man, all this stuff that you got, you got a business, you got this thing. And I was like, you don't realize. And then they'll tell me, um, hey, man, I wish I was you, man. I wish I had your right hand. I was like, then, if you did, then will you be willing to go with the sacrifice that I did? I wasn't always having things in my life or was successful in my life. 
uh, I had to work towards these things in my life. Lots of times, it wasn't easy. It wasn't hard. I mean, it was uh, hard. Sometimes it was mentally drained sometimes, you know, knocking on doors, being denied. You know, these different things that people go through that we are not lucky. I mean, we put in the work. I put in the work each and every day. I made sacrifices doing things in my life. And that's the only way you're going to be able to run a business, keep things going smooth. You got to deal with stress, all these different things you have to go through at all times. So, and so you have to realize that after you have conquered, and not only conquered because they get greater and greater each time, but you learn how to be able to deal with it in a better way. So we have to realize that when you make these sacrifices and being an entrepreneur or being in the schools or doing things of skills that you have, that talents that you have, it becomes success. Because you made them sacrifices and if some things come success and you put in that work, things are not going to pop up overnight and say, hey, oh, it's exciting, man. I conquered this. You know, I, I could probably think about one in a million that somebody may have. Boom, that might have happened like that. But if you don't put in the work, you don't make them sacrifices, then guess what? You won't be able to conquer them success. Some people have to work on their marriages every day in order to make these successful things in their lives. So when I talk about success, I'm not just talking about riches. I'm talking about being able to be comfort, being happy of what you want to do. So that's what success is to me, is being able to long term, enjoy the things that you like to do, and be comfortable about it. Be happy. Enjoy your your family. You got for a lot of free time. You got things you can do. So that's what I'm talking about, success. And it comes with benefits, you know. I mean, um, sacrifice comes with many things. It comes with success. It comes with um, benefits as well, you know. I mean, that's when, you know, you have money because you put in the work. I mean, you got different things that goes on in your life so i just thank you all for just joining uh listen to me talk about sacrifice there's many different things about sacrifice maybe you can jot them down in the comments or whatever but i appreciate it just keep the daily momentum going you got to keep pushing get excited hey just take a chance take a step Put the sacrifice, put your work in, do your things because things don't come overnight. You find a lot of ministers or leaders and people, they figure they could jump in and just take over and do these things. It doesn't work that way. You got to stay humble, listen, learn, and, and be obedient with God. And sometimes God is trying to take you through a train to get you where you need to be. So thank you guys for just joining me. Uh, there's more of, of these um, videos that I do have, take time out and listen to some of them and just to find out, see who I am and who that you, that I can help you out to be better. Okay, thank you, bye-bye. You have a blessed day, bye-bye. Keep pushing.